Welcome back to UAT Solutions. In this tutorial, Star Delta starter power and control wiring is explained with a basic introduction of hardware used to build a Star Delta three-phase induction motor starter. Legends are shown in the table. Please keep them in mind to understand the wiring diagram as short references will be used. Some major hardware used in the starter are shown. Wiring diagram wiring explanation. Diagram explanation. First, let's see how the power circuit wiring is done before we move to the control circuit. Three phases, L1, L2, and L3. Enter the MCB input, and from the output of the MCB power is supplied to the input of contactor K. From the output of contactor K3 phase are connected on the overload relay and then supplied to the motor terminals. L1 is connected to the U1, L2 is connected to the V1, and L3 is connected to the W1. Now let's move to the contactor K13 phases from the MCB connected at the input of contactor K1. And the output of K1 contactor is linked with the contactor K2, and also connected to the motor terminals respectively L1 connected to V2, L2, consected to U2 and L3 connected to W2. Now let's move to the contactor K2. The input of the contactor K2 is interjumped to create a star connection, and the output of K2 is linked with K1 to create a delta connection. Once the circuit breaker is on, these points will close and power will be supplied at normally open contact 13 of the on switch here. A neutral line will pass through the overload, normally close contact 95 and 96 to the contactor K2 and K1, normally close points 11 and 12. Timer coil A2 is linked with contactor K1 contact 11 to supply the neutral line. After on switch is pressed, contact 13 and 14 will close and complete the circuit, so voltage are supplied to the off switch normally closed, contact 11 and 12, and continue to the magnetic coil of contactor K at A1 and the timer coil A1. From the timer's normally close contact, 55 and 56 power supplied to the contactor K2, coil A1. In result of this contactor K and contactor K2 energizes completing the star circuit for the induction motor to start in star mode at 33% of power. And contactor K, normally open contact 13 and 14, will turn to close contact and continue to supply power, while on switch contacts 13 and 14 becomes open after releasing the push button. After four seconds of star mode is being energized, timer will change its normally closed contact 55 and 56 to open circuit and will close its normally open contact 67 and 68, and power is applied at contactor K1 coil. Neutral is provided to contactor K1 coil at A2 from the normally closed contact of contactor K2. This process will cause contactor K2 to go off and K1 to come in changing the star connection to delta connection. Also from the on switch a direct line is connected to normally open contact 13 of contactor K1 which will turn to close contact upon K1, energizing and will supply power to the K1 coil when timer cuts the line at contact 67 and 68. Thanks for watching. Please share and subscribe.